He's my Lord. Here is the Lord one. <coughs> Who can calm the storms of life like my Lord? He gives rest to the weary. Jesus says, Come unto me, all that are weary and heavy laden, and I will give you rest. That's where we find our rest to in Jesus Christ. And new life to the hopeless. To the world that's out there today is, that is hopeless. There, there, is hope, there is hope in Christ Jesus, my Lord. There is no doubt about it. He's my Lord. There's no doubt about it this morning that Jesus Christ is my Lord. And he gives me strength when I go through storms in my life. And he gives strength to you as you walk through storms in your life. Let's sing that chorus a couple of times to the glory of God, please, and then we'll have a word of prayer. Lord, 
while we're in this place this morning of, of complacency, out in their comfortable place this morning in your house. There are many men and women and young people this morning, Jesus, you don't know where to turn to in life. But I pray this morning, Lord, that they will turn their eyes upon you, Jesus, that they will look fully into your wonderful face, that the things of earth will grow strangely dim in the light of your glory and grace. Father, I pray this morning, Jesus, that the people in our province, Lord, will turn their eyes upon Jesus, and they will look fully into your wonderful face. And then they know, then they will know, Lord, without a shadow of a doubt, that you are real, that you live within men and women's hearts, Lord, who know you as their personal Lord and Savior. And Father, this morning I pray for salvation for those throughout our province this morning, throughout our country, and throughout our communities. And did not know you, Jesus, as their personal Lord and Savior. Then I pray, Heavenly Father, that the convicting power of God, the Holy Spirit, will sweep over their heart in life. And I pray, Heavenly Father, that they will know that the peace of God that passes all understanding. And then, that, Lord, that they will know that it guards each man and woman's heart in Christ Jesus. Father, this morning I pray, Lord, for every need in this place. Lord, I don't know all needs in this place, but you do, Jesus. Then I pray, Heavenly Father, that you will meet us at our point of need. <coughs> Father, our, our prayer request this morning, that's all we have to do, Lord, is send them up to you. And then you, Lord, intervenes for each and every one of us. And Father, this morning I pray for a remaining part of this service, that you, Jesus, will draw near to each and every one of us through the power of your Holy Spirit. Father, continue to hear and answer prayer. And to you, Lord, we will give honor, glory, and thanks and praise. In Jesus' name I pray and ask it. Amen and amen.